How to get electricity if the world is dead, the night is colder than regret, and your only friend is a moldy sandwich. The grid's gone. Cities are just tombstones with Wi-Fi routers. Your flashlight is dead, your phone is useless, and you still think maybe, just maybe, someone will answer if you power up that radio. Spoiler, they won't. But we're making electricity anyway. Start with vinegar. Not for your fries, because fries are extinct. For power. Grab some scrap metal, copper wire from a dead toaster, nails from a half-burnt doorframe, anything sharp and corroded. Dunk the copper and the nail into the vinegar. Boom. That sour juice rips electrons right out of the metal like a drunk raider looting your camp. Line up a few of these jars like sad little soldiers. Wire them together. More jars, more volts. Don't lick it. Unless you like pain-flavored science. The vinegar is acid. The metals hate each other. That hate becomes electricity. Tiny, pathetic, beautiful sparks of survival. Enough to make an LED flicker, maybe whisper life into a radio. If it hums, congrats, you're alive. For now. Science doesn't care if the world ended. You've got vinegar batteries, a radio that coughs static, and the crushing silence of humanity's graveyard. Enjoy.